three important priorities. Now, please look up. God gave us 24 hours. The unit of destiny is time. Time is the unit of destiny. That means that your entire lifespan is measured as a function of time. Every day that passes, chronos, we call it, the passage of time, it counts to your overall destiny. And it matters that we are equipped with the knowledge that helps us to live lives that are effective and relevant. I had the privilege to be profoundly mentored by Dr. Miles Munro. And so it gave me a very, very intelligent perspective about life, about purpose, about vision. And I'm ever grateful for it. Hallelujah. Now, not everything in your life produces the same effect as far as your destiny is concerned. Please listen. God gave us 24 hours and is full of several activities that can move us towards destiny. But not all of them move us at the same level. And not all of them carry the same gravity. Are we together now? It is very important. I think one of the... The wrong perceptions that our generation has is that we allocate equal time and equal priority and equal interest to everything and anything. Your time for play is equal to your time of prayer. Your time of gisting is equal to your time of personal development. There must be a system of prioritizing your life. Please listen very carefully. And so I want to show you the three, in my opinion, and supported by scripture, the three most important things in a man's life. These three areas I want to show you tonight are worth dying for. Not everything is worth dying for. Hallelujah. There are people who have died for nothing. There are people who have died the deaths of fools. It is important to know what is worth committing your energy, your time, and your money. Listen, at the end of your life, there are only few things that will make your life count. Believe me when I tell you this. In the maze of several activities clamoring for your attention, you know, the average young man is, is like a magnet attracting different things that need your attention in life. And I have found out in my little experience and by the privilege of wisdom and mentorship and the word that in the end of your life, there are not more than four, five things that are worth living for. So in, in our busyness, our attempt to make money, marry, have children, serve God, grow ministries, expand, all of these things are important. But a time must come in your life where you have to just shut the door and say, what is really important? Because many of us, as I'll be showing you, if you don't know what is important, you will major on the minors and you will minor on the majors. Are we together now? Praise the Lord. Right, so very quickly, the first...